dear students i have come in front of you with another grammatical item and today's arrangement is reflexive pronoun and emphatic pronoun again i request all of you just to subscribe my channel and this is my request before i start my lesson you see that re means again and flexive mean that turns back that means when the action of the doer is attributed to himself or herself the self word is called reflexive pronoun for example i am giving you example i saved myself here saved spelling s h a v e d i saved myself that means my action has been attributed to myself on my cheeks so myself is reflexive pronoun okay i fanned myself f a n n e d here the action of the doer has been attributed to myself so myself is a reflexive pronoun okay again i am telling you about emphatic pronoun i washed my clothes myself that means my action has been attributed to my clothes so myself here is an emphatic pronoun the gardener just nurtured the garden nurtured the plants himself so the gardener's effort has been attributed to the plants not on himself so himself is an emphatic pronoun so it is clear that the action of the doer is attributed to himself or herself and the action of the doer is attributed to another thing when it is attributed to himself or herself or myself the self word is called reflexive pronoun and when the action of the doer is attributed to another thing the self word is called reflex sorry an emphatic pronoun clear so don't confuse when you are telling with somebody or you are speaking to somebody in english though although you should not follow grammar i think you must keep it in mind what a reflexive pronoun is and what emphatic pronoun is so it's a very short program and again i am requesting you to subscribe my channel thank you good night